Welcome to the goon, baby! Oh, just a big, clean fish. Casting, <laughs> <laughs> but take a look at this. We're like, we were just hot and sunny right there. And now we're not. Say it's not good. Not good. Okay. All right. That's that's not good. Um, all right. All right. Let's put. We gotta put everything away. Let's go. Let's go. Oh! Oh my! <laughs> yeah. <sighs> okay. So. Basically, we put our cameras away. We got on the big motor and we pulled up on the backside of this island because it was the only thing that would like protect us from the wind. So we just pulled up on the backside of this island and now it's starting to like thunder and lightning. And uh, we just, we need to get off the boat because it's not safe to be on the boat when it's lightning literally right above our heads. So we found this island and literally on this island is like an abandoned house. There, there is nothing else around here. We're like, there's not even cabins on this section of the lake. We just rolled up on this island. Like how many miles are we from from where we're staying? Like we're far away. Dude, we're like we're good. Yeah, I don't even. We're far. We're pretty far. So we. I mean, like we're not running back now. No, not in the storm. No. So let's just honestly, let's just pop up on this island, chill here till this passes. If it passes, yeah, and dude, then... it's still looking pretty sketchy right now. Yeah, I don't know the laws on like trespassing or anything up here, but like we got to get off the water. So we're just gonna we're just gonna do it. I don't know. Hello? 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 I don't know, dude. It's something. We're out of the wind now. Oh, God. Dude. <laughs> if, if someone's living in this, man. This is rugged. I don't know. We're not trying to, like, mess it up. We just got to... Yeah, no, we're not trying to... Get out of the weather. I don't know, man. It looks pretty sketchy. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, there is a roof here, so I think we're just going to chill for a minute. So, uh, huge shout out to whoever's place this is. Sorry, we'll, we'll leave <laughs> in a minute. I don't know. Yeah, dude, let's go get another let's one. Let's do this. Yeah, that was, that was clutch that there was like actually a shelter on that, but... <laughs> <laughs> I think it's time to get back in the boat and get the heck out All of right, here. Alright, back to fishing. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> 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 Look at that little leap. <laughs> Holy cow, dude. This thing is power. Ryan's on. Get him, bro. Stay pinned, girl. I don't know, dude. It just feels big. It's coming. It's coming at the boat. Come on, girl. Come on, girl. We're gonna get her. I don't know if it's on there still, dude. Oh, it's a big pike. Big pike. Oh, big pike. Nice. Big pike. Got a babe. Yes. Got a babe. This pike. Dude, smoked it. Freaking biting. Freaking biting. biting. All right, we were just running down a spot that we actually had a huge pike blow up yesterday. And it's just a really good musky spot, so we figured we'll just run it again. Because um, we've been having kind of a decent day, actually. And we're running down the spot, and I just made a super long cast, like two reel turns in, just absolutely got torqued. And, uh, Oh, we thought it was a muskie for sure, but it's a freaking stud pike. So we just got it in the net. I'm gonna get it unhooked real quick and I'll show it to you. All right, it's our second big pike of the day. And uh, we're getting some freaking good fish in the boat today. That's a stud that pike, a freaking dude. Thick one. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Same deal on a chatterbait, just burning it across those shallow weeds. Oh man. Big hit. Yes. Big head. Big old head on her. <laughs> that a babe. Yeah. Should we get a couple picks? Yeah, let's get some picks. 
<laughs> yes, <laughs> Give me some yes, of that. Yes. They're biting. They're biting. We're gonna I think we got a really good shot at catching another muskie tonight. I really think we we got tons of spots to hit. We gotta get moving right now. Right let's go, now. let's go. Oh, that was a sick video we did. We didn't even like it. What's the today? Oh, fish on! Fish on! Instant! Instant! Get the net! Instant! Oh my gosh! Right in the cast! Get the net! Oh, stay pinned! Stay pinned! Oh my gosh! Yeah! Feels good, bro. Feels good. Come up, she's coming up. She's coming up. Get her, get her, get her, get her, get her. Get her, bro. Yes! 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 Sunset, last light! Last light! Dude, you the, the lure hit the water and it went boom. I didn't even feel head strike. I just saw boom. And I just went boom. Last light. Thank you. Yes! Yeah. <laughs> beautiful sunset. Yes. I don't know if you guys can see this oh. on GoPro, but. <laughs> Give me some of that! Give me some of that! Yes. Yes. yes! Can you guys see this in the background? Literally beautiful sunset. Oh, right on the tip of that point, right there. I made a totally long cast. Literally when the bait hit the water, it went whoosh. Dirty shallow. And we fought it all the way in and Ryan freaking made an awesome that oh, job. Dude, it was caught up in the rods. We have so much crap in the boat. It's like <laughs> out of control. Literally last light, last spot. Just nonchalantly, we're just casting bomb and bait. Ryan's kept that chatter bait in his hand ever since he stoked his. And um, I've done the same because I was like, man, that's just been the hot bait. Like, we haven't seen much sign on any other bait. They haven't shown themselves at all, basically. So he kept it in his hand, I kept it in mine. Two fish day. Yes. Total comeback. Like, today has been the craziest day. I'm talking to you guys really quick before we grab this fish out of the net. It's just chilling in there. <sighs> Rain and thunderstorms this morning then cloudy, super windy, then more rain, then it got really hot, and then it rained again. Then Ryan caught his fish, and right after Ryan caught his fish, it got like 75 degrees and sunny. We fished for an hour more, and all of a sudden, it's like thunderstorming and 20 mile an hour winds. We go hide on an island in a house. We wait that storm out, we're like, okay, we've got an hour and a half left to fish. We hit two spots, one spot we worked really, really hard, and then we came and ran to this spot that Ryan's like, I saw a bunch of bait here yesterday on the side imaging. So we're like, ah, oh, whatever, we'll hit it, it's last light. Boom, baby, boom, let's look at this fish. She's a gorgeous fish, gorgeous, gorgeous fish. All right. Oh, beautiful, beautiful, <gasps> beautiful, beautiful. Oh my Red fins, I love it. Gorgeous, gorgeous musky. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna get her back in the water. We're gonna get a couple pictures and then we're gonna let this beautiful girl go. Oh my goodness. Oh, gorgeous, gorgeous fish. She's beautiful. <laughs> I'm so pumped, dude. I can't even, oh, I can't even tell you what we did to get a couple of these muskies today. Gorgeous, beautiful evening out with a good pal. Just stoked a beautiful fish. Let's release her. Let's release her. She's good. She's so charged up. Oh my goodness. She's so charged up. <laughs> beautiful, beautiful. Oh my goodness. She's doing so good. And there she goes. There she goes. Goodbye. Thanks for the ride. Thanks for the ride. Boom, baby! Give me some of that! <laughs> All right, let's cast a little bit more and we'll go back and have our wonderful dinner. Victory dinner tonight, What, what do we dude. got cooking for dinner? We got that mule deer shoulder that was in the crock pot all day. It was in there for like 12 hours or something ridiculous. This is a freaking masterpiece. This is like... 
eating like kings out in the back of the truck. Uh, yeah, just got this thing. Oh my god. It's so tender. We should this be able is to like, this is like six it. pounds of meat, by the way. So I don't know off. how we're going to hose all this. Here we go. Oh. <laughs> Falls right off right the off bone. Right off the bone, baby. <laughs> That's going to be Oh my yeah, goodness. I'm looking forward to that. Oh my goodness. All right. Let's see. Let's do it. Good morning, Elmo. Oh, good morning, good morning. All right, guys. Last day of the trip. We only half a day of fishing today, and then we gotta head back down to Minnesota. So today is all about focusing on just like the places we think that we've either contacted a fish previously or places that just looked the best out of anything we looked for. We're really not gonna do any exploring, but uh, it's coming to an end and we don't want it to. That's the worst part about coming up here is that sometimes you gotta leave. So today's gonna be a good day, I think. Weather cooperated, it laid down again, and uh, we're gonna get after it. Spot number one, we're starting where we ended last night. Hopefully we can pop another big one off of here. Here we go. All right, the point Sam caught that fish off is like right in front of us, right here. We're gonna start on this little island outside of it and uh, see if we can't just find something else. There's just bait all over this, so. Start with the chatterbait again. Send that thing out there, see if we can make it happen. I don't think so. Okay. Good one. It's big. Other side. Other side. Oh. Get him, bro. Get him, bro. Other side. Other side. I don't know. It's a good sized fish, though. Oh, it's God. He's dogging you. It's gotta be. Here we go. Here we go. It's coming up. It's coming up. Big pike. Ooh. Big pike. Big pike. Oh. Big pike. Gotta be. Spot lockers. Big pike. Oh, I thought it was one. Thought it was her. Oh, that was cool. All right. So we're just like rolling spots. We're just having a conversation, and all of a sudden, whack! Just get totally smoked. And uh, we thought 100% musky. It come like came right up to the boat and giant pike, magnum. Like it's a magnum pike. Magnum pike. Same Long deal. Fish. Oh boy, come on, come on. <laughs> Dude, this is a stud pike. Check that out. <laughs> stud pike. That's that was freaking wild, man. It just jacked it too. Woo! God, totally right. stud pike. <laughs> We're running out of time. It's like almost 10 o'clock. We got a couple hours left to fish. We're just gonna get this thing back right away and uh, keep fishing. <laughs> nice job, dude. Sick. Nice that job. Was sick. Let's get a bigger one. Let's get one. Okay. <sighs> All right, guys. We're looking for a Hail Mary here. We're going to hit like one or two more spots. Um, I think we're gonna run back. We're kind of back in the south portion, back towards the camp now. We kind of made a long run this morning, working our way back, and we're just hoping for one more freaking bite. We're just trying. What do you think, dude? One more, one more. We want one more. 
<laughs> we're, we're gonna we're gonna fish our butts off right till the bitter end here we have like maybe an hour of fishing left and we gotta we gotta head south and get off the lake um it's a grinder all the time but we made it happen yesterday and i think we can try to make it happen again today <sighs> we're gonna get one we're gonna get one more one more one more one more All right, guys, we're finally back at camp, and uh, the fishing on this trip is officially over, unfortunately. So we're getting the camp loaded up. We got the tent taken down. We're just jamming everything into the truck, and uh, we just gotta load the boat up and get on the road. But we had an awesome trip. Uh, man, we stuck some good fish. We grinded, we worked hard, and uh, I don't think this will be the last time we're up here. We got some unfinished business, so. This won't be the last time we're on the goon. Crazy. The goon was crazy. I was lucky enough to have Ryan bring me. Thank you so much, by the way. Dude, absolutely. <sighs> this lake is, it's totally different than anything else I've ever musky fished. It's dirty water. It's got a lot of shallow cabbage. Uh, the fish here eat, they don't follow. It's just like, it seemed like a locating game. As soon as Dude, we could locate so one, which was super hard, but like as soon as we located one, we knew if we hit that spot a couple times during the day, one of those times we could get it to go. And um, it was fun. It was fun to learn this body of water. After a trip like this, you're just like, <laughs> when do we come back? You know what I mean? Yes. Like we have to come back. It's like, you feel like you only barely scratch the surface. There's yeah. so much water There's up here so much. in Ontario that it's, um, it was a total blast. So we'll be back, we'll 100% be back. Yeah, absolutely. So. Thanks for watching. I hope we could share with you just like some of what musky fishing up here is like. Like we said before, it's just like so much different than anywhere else in Canada fishing for muskies. And this is just a really unique place to fish. So I hope some of you guys might be willing to like come up here and give it a shot because it's a blast. So thanks for watching. Until next time, keep fishing. Peace.